One of the things that I get asked a lot or throughout my whole career, um, have you ever peed in a race car? <laughs> Apparently, this is something that you are now doing. Uh, at least you've talked about it twice in the past six months. Is it true that um, you did it again today at the race? Oh, absolutely. It felt amazing. <laughs> I mean, what I liked about it is that the car wasn't stopped. I was able to do it under caution. But I'm not kidding you. It went from the beginning of the caution to the end. I just kept going. And we get that question from time to time, but it's it's fun to answer. Uh, ha for me, it probably happened a half a dozen times in my career. There's just times when it just is you cannot – you can't hold it <clears throat> too much, and you got too much race left. Uh, am I to believe that the you know just six months ago that was the first time in your entire career you've ever done that? Yeah, it was uh, Atlanta. So how did you go your entire career without ever like you know lap fifty having a full bladder? <laughs> I don't know. I I just the the bladder was bigger i guess and it's shrunk <laughs> over time i just don't know old. what exactly it is but you're getting old uh, not able to hold it as much but um but for me i really i i like it now because it keeps me drinking like when i get so full before and i was not able to go i'd have to stop drinking in the oh. car and so i wasn't hydrating myself because i was in such pain and so now that i'm able to let it go I'm able to keep <laughs> hydrating throughout the entire race. So I, I love right. it. <laughs> so when you when you take a pee in the car, what lap what lap in the race was this this week? Uh, I was under caution probably uh, the end of second stage. Okay. So you not After. not too late. Yeah. Um do you tell the interior guy? Do you let the guys know right away? <laughs> I, no, I told him this weekend when we got out in Victory Lane and he was like Damn it. He's like, I got to watch that thing again. <laughs> <laughs> hey, when, um, so you got a white suit. Um, I do. Yeah. So when I had a white suit, one time I used to have a white suit. So if I ever peed in the car, I'd get them to bring me a Gatorade or any kind of a colored drink so I could pour that on me before I'd get out so <laughs> nobody could see my yellow piss stains all over my suit. Oh, well, man. There was, there was, trust me, there's many, many text conversations between myself and JGR says, stop with the white suits. <laughs> <laughs> that is trouble, man. You're going to have to figure out how to get some Gatorade and you got to make yeah. it, you get the yellow Gatorade and you blend it in. Yeah. Um, <laughs> That's a better move right there. <laughs> That's right. All right, man. Hey, thanks for calling in today. Know you're busy all week. Um, good luck in Coda. Um, enjoy those track limits and uh, you'll be missing the short track racing that you did this past weekend I'm sure on, on, on Sunday but have fun man we'll see you alright thank y'all All right. <laughs> that brought back a lot of memories all the, the yellow Gatorade times that yeah <laughs> uh, you, you know you're like embarrassed you, 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 you can't hold it I mean you're, you're racing along and you're like ah, it's distracting so you gotta get rid of the distraction and you're uncomfortable and, but you can't do it during green flag. You have to kind of wait for a yellow to focus on it really? happening. Yeah, so you'll you it takes know, yellow, a lot of focus. Yellow to do comes that. out, and you're like, because you're. Yeah. I don't know what it is about your the body. Yellow comes out, and the yellow comes out. Yeah, yeah. yellow comes yellow out, and the yellow comes yeah. out. And you're in full yellow mode. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot there, a lot of puns. Um, but yeah, I would get done, and I'd go, "Hey, bring me a yellow Gatorade before I get." You know, <laughs> I, I really am thirsty. Yeah. And so I'd pour that yellow Gatorade on my suit to sort of blend it in so I didn't hop out and just like, oh, Grandpa peed on himself. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, but um, I did. When I, when I um, had this happen, I felt so bad about it because it is nasty, right? The mm -hmm. interior guy has to clean this up. Monday, whenever the car's going to come back, they take the inserts out. They do all this. They wash these cars. So I know they're going to deep dive into this interior. And so I'm not going to make this a surprise. They're going to smell it immediately. <laughs> um, but I always had a hard time breaking the news uh, to my interior guy, Adam. But um, I know that we have uh, Denny's interior guy's phone number. We do. Should we give him a call? Ask him how, how this experience is going for him? All right, so um, we got on the line here, Denny's interior guy. Denny's interior guy, how you doing? I'm not very good, to be honest with you. <laughs> oh, really? 
So, uh, Denny, I assume you're you're a little fed up with this new trend of Denny peeing in his car that he started this year. Yeah, I mean, this isn't what I signed up for. You know, I don't clean up pee. That's 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 not my job. I know, but it's part of the deal. Um, I'm surprised that it's taken him this long in his career to finally start this process, but now he seems to like it. So, uh, happening on uh, happening on the regular now, you're getting this uh, this issue every other week. Well, I'll say this: uh, in his old age, yes, <laughs> he is uh, more prone to peeing in the seat for sure. But I'm talking to JGR management right now to try to give me a raise because because this is ridiculous. <laughs> and I'll be honest with you, I can't eat asparagus anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm traumatized. I can't listen to Yellow by Coldplay. No. Oh, man. You sound pissed. Uh, yeah, no pun intended, right? Yeah. So, um, you know, does he? how does he break the news? Does I guess he's told us he said something in Victory Lane this past weekend. You're happy you're, you're win- you've won the race, but then you get that dropped on you. Yeah, well, I mean, he kind of pulls me aside, and then he says, hey, uh, and then he pauses for a little bit, and he's like, uh. Uh, I'm sorry, I peed in the seat again. And I'm like, did you just pee? And he's like, maybe a little bit. <laughs> right right then in Right there, yeah. yeah. He can't control it. I oh, mean, man. it's like he, he turns, you know, a certain age, and he just starts peeing all the time. I guess he feels like when he's in that driver's suit, it's just okay to go anywhere. <laughs> I guess. That's I mean, pretty- we're talking like we're talking to JGR management about you know getting uh, yellow colored suits at least. I mean, <laughs> at least it could it could blend in at the best, you yeah. know. Yep. Well, man, we. Um, <clears throat> I have a question for yeah. him. Actually, did it impact the racing service at Bristol at all? Well, I'm glad you brought that up because I'll be honest. I listen to Denny's podcast. Um, sometimes it pisses me off. No pun intended. Again, but. Um, I have a theory. Yeah. I think that Denny's secret now, he, he said someone peed in the tire compound. I think Denny peed in the co- tire compound. That's, that's my, my theory right now. You think Denny went to Akron, Ohio and pissed in the Goodyear <laughs> yep. mix? Absolutely. I think, uh, mm-hmm. I think he's got a little bit of an unfair advantage and I'll be honest, I wouldn't be surprised if Denny went Saturday night back to Bristol while everyone was gone and went all over that racetrack and just peed all over it. <laughs> Who needs resin? And he's Jeez. the only one that knew, right? Yeah. So he, he knew exactly how to run in the res, resin or, you know, the PP. And <laughs> he knew yeah. exactly what to do. <laughs> yeah. Shredding tires up. How to run in the PP. Uh, yeah. <laughs> They're going to call it PJ11 the next time they put down. PP11. Yeah. PP11. Oh yeah. We got that all in t shirt. We need PP11 t shirts. Yeah. All in. Uh, he's all out. All out of P. All out. Golly. Well, I'm, I don't... Actu- I'm actually uh, sorry not to interrupt, but I was on the phone with Urinators Anonymous and I'm trying to. <laughs> sign him up for classes oh, so yeah? yeah they meet every uh every thursday and they control they try to uh, practice controlling their bladders yeah, so bladder. i think hopefully that's hopefully that helps them oh, man well i don't envy your situation <laughs> all right thank you for uh talking to us today denny's interior guy i appreciate the uh appreciate the phone call and uh yeah good luck i guess i guess good luck good luck with that race yeah, thanks. <laughs> <laughs>